Yo, what is up guys? Here's your boy Matt Max today, bringing you a video on the top 5 things you may not know you could do within Black Ops 3. But guys, before we get into today's video, if we can shoot for 150 likes down below, that would be absolutely awesome. If you guys are new around here and want to see some more awesome Black Ops 3 content, be sure to hit that subscription button down below so you never miss out on a future upload. But with all of that out of the way, I think we should drop into today's video and uh, show you guys 5 awesome features you probably didn't know within Black Ops 3. Now, as you guys saw from the intro here, we're using the MVP baseball bat, and you can use this to actually hit back war machine grenades, which I thought was pretty awesome. We did try with normal grenades and like cushion grenades and stuff like that. The timing of it was a lot harder compared to using like the war machine, which I thought was a pretty cool feature. I don't know when you'd ever find yourself in this situation, firing you down with a war machine and uh, you trying to hit them back <laughs> with the MVP. I don't know. If you ever found yourself in this situation, I suppose it's cool to use. I don't know. It's just an awesome thing that you can do with Black Ops 3 and uh, a lot of you guys probably didn't know you could do that. Now this next one up here is actually a pretty cool feature I found out by doing myself. I just happened to do it. And uh, if you ever find yourself running through a door and there's a hive and they start scrambling around on your screen, what you can actually do is activate your specialist as you can see here and it actually blows them away and kills them all, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, I've used it in a couple of situations now. I've gone through doors. There's been a hive there. I've walked through it and thought, oh, that's the end of me. And then I realised I've got Heatwave on. Shabam! Enabled that and bam, they're all gone, which I thought was another awesome tip you guys could probably use, you know, if you're going on long kill streaks. I don't know, you run off a nuclear and you get hit by a hive, you're like, oh god damn, what am I going to do? Shabang! You got that heat wave. Alright, so the next one up here actually involves the fire break specialist once again. This one's a lot harder to do than all the others. Uh, if you ever find yourself in the situation where you've just been burnt by a purifier and you've literally got two seconds to live, if you're in the proximity, I don't know, of like two feet of water, what you can actually do, I mean, it's got to be really quick, you can actually dip yourself in the water and it'll actually get rid of the flames, which you'd obviously assume fire in water will obviously put it out. Next up here, oh my god, this one's pretty crazy. This is using the Annihilator pistol. Now, this thing is a one-shot kill on enemies, but what you probably didn't know is if a mothership ever came in, it actually takes three shots to take the mothership down, which, I don't know, it's a massive aircraft in the sky, and you can take it down in three shots of the Annihilator, and it's gone off the map. And not only that, you get a ton of XP for doing it as well, so if you guys ever happen to have the Annihilator on as your specialist, a mothership comes in, you can take that thing down instantly, and with only three shots, which is absolutely crazy. Now this last one that you guys probably didn't know, it's not the most useful because it's really really hard to do. But if you ever find yourself with the enemies having a HDXD on the map and you can see it within range, if you have the black hat on, you can actually lock down on the HDXD and you can actually take over control of the HDXD and it is now yours. Obviously that's what the black hat does is take over enemy score streaks. So another cool tip, I thought you guys might want to know if that situation ever crops up. I mean, you can use it. I mean, nobody ever runs a black hat anyway. But yeah, another awesome tip. Like I said, be sure to drop a like on today's video. That'd be absolutely awesome. I'd definitely appreciate the support. As well as that, let me know in the comment section down below if you know any other cool tips and tricks that you can do within Black Ops 3. If you're new around here, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below. Like I said, Tuesday's coming up. Loads of DLC content coming out. We'll be putting loads of it up on the channel. So be sure to subscribe for then. And apart from that, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. It's been your boy, Matt Max. I'm